positivity That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah These days I don't worry about much I think we should have some more fun I still dream about the days when we were young What's up everybody, it's your girl TJ back with another video talks with TJ aka TJ2 swoosh chains or as some people like to say all the chains although I am only rocking two right now. Thank you again so much for tuning into this video. Yeah, everything looks a little bit different. I figure why not? This is the time to try new things, to switch it up and that's exactly what I decided to do today. So normally you guys are used to seeing me film right there in front of my uh, sneaker prints by Hang Your Soul but today I figured let's just take a seat and talk for a little bit about what you guys just saw. So you saw brand new cargos from Black Taylor. That's right. Now, uh, I did debut my very first pair from them, I believe maybe last week or two weeks ago, and I'll make sure to link the video somewhere here so that you guys can check that out. And now I have my second pair, so I'll give you my thoughts on these. Now, please remember this is a totally unsponsored video. Um, I love the first pair that I got, the green pair, and a lot of you have given me a lot of good feedback on my Instagram, so thank you for that. Um, if you do not follow me on Instagram, you you can find me at talks.with.tj. Uh, you can see a lot of the different outfit picks or ways that I will style the clothes, right? So when you guys see some of the B-roll in videos here, if I get a new item in, whether it be shoes or clothes, I will go ahead and post more pictures on Instagram. So just make sure we're connecting on all platforms. So I wanted to get a second pair of cargos and that's exactly what I did here. So this is considered, this is the N23 style. Now it's a gray, a really light gray, and then a darker gray, just so you guys know. The straps are black, so you pretty much have a gray and black aesthetic um, in the two-tone. So it's kind of layered right here and it's all stitched on. You do have a button here for this pocket. I don't know if I showed that in the first part. You do have a button here for this pocket. And then there actually is print on the front um, on this pocket. It says create in quotation marks. And then it says in order to be irreplaceable, you must always be different. I like that. I like that. You must always be different. So it says irreplaceable and then it has like these little lines and it says robot spaceship unlimited energy wormhole universe apparently these are some space pants y'all uh, as the last ship sailed towards the distant horizon i sat there watching on a rock my mind slowly drifting away forming into my dream tale apparently we are getting someone's uh last little memoirs as they went off into some unknown place in 2019 which is what it feels like when we're all living in 2020 right now. But here you guys go, so you can take a look. It's uh, MMK Union, so that's what you'll find. The script, or I should say the text, the printed text on one. Uh, with the cords now, I went ahead and yes, I will dead stock loop <laughs> my pants um, just because I don't like the cords to hang. Uh, what does this say? Guildmar, I think. <laughs> All right, so you guys can see those right there. You do have pockets on the back, which is nice. You got pockets everywhere, right? So the pants are not tech in the sense that they will keep you completely dry or they're gonna wick away sweat or anything like that. Remember, tech has usually a purpose. So the material, the functionality, it's meant to actually do something beyond just look good when you wear it. I'm just trying to look good when I wear these and that's exactly what I'll be able to do. Now for the actual fit, let's talk about that um, for, for the fit. And this, I'll show you the bottom cuff. So remember the last ones you guys saw, they have the straps and you actually strap them. Um, I would not wear that other pair that I got, which is N17. I would not wear it just straight down. I don't like the way it looks. So I would definitely wear it strapped. And with this one, you can actually tighten the toggles on the bottom if you would need to. Um, in terms of the fit, so I got a 28. That is the smallest size, I believe on their site for these. Let me just see. Yeah, 28 is the smallest size that you can get for these. And I'll be honest with you, for a actual regular fit, I should have gone with a 30. And then for a baggier fit, I should have gone with a 32. Now I say that because 
Even though on the website it says normal style, I would actually rank these as slim. Um, trying to, putting my hands in my actual pockets for me to raise my leg all the way up, that would just not be the most comfortable thing to do. So I would actually say these are more of a slim fitting pant. If you want that, if you want more of a tighter style, then go with that, okay? Having slim denim, you know, that, that works for some people for some styles, I have that as well. But for my cargos, I actually do want them to be just a little bit like roomy so if I just want to lounge around or rock the baggier fit, I can. Not that I would want to return these. I still like the way they fit. They just weren't the most optimal fit or what I thought they were going to be. I'll say that, but I like the material a lot. Now, just so you guys know, uh, when you get this particular style in with the material, it'll come really, really, really wrinkled. I was able on a low setting to iron these and have no problem. If you have a steamer or a hand steamer, you can probably use that as well. And I think it will do just fine. Now let's talk about how I chose to style these because once again, you can always style your pants, your shoes, however you like. Um, and I'm not styling them in the traditional tech way, really. I'm just styling how I like to style them. Um, one way you can style them is more with a tech thought, or I'm not gonna say thought, with a tech aesthetic in mind that that's the, that's the vernacular I'm looking for. Um, because as you know, like Acronym is known for having the very techy look, right? It has the um, straps, it has the buckles, which apparently mine is unbuckled back here. Okay. <laughs> Um, it has the straps, it has loops, it has zippers, and it's meant to be more of an actual like functional style shoe, right? And yes, I do wear mine. <laughs> so I have two pairs of acronym uh, Presto Mids. I have the Vault Black and White pair, as you saw here that I styled. And then I also have the Racer Pink, and I think it's called the Photo Blue. And shout out to CO Niles 23 again, because he sold those to me. Uh, beginning of last year, I think he sold those to me. So you can style them with a whole tech aesthetic um, I say just the aesthetic and the look because if you are actually buying real tech wear that's functional it tends to get up there in price and that's not what I was going for but I wanted to be able to play up the cargo look with the tech of these shoes and I think it came off really really well um, so you have this I had more of just the uh, I guess athleisure uh, look with the crop long sleeve Nike essential t-shirt. Now you can find those probably on nike.com somewhere. I, I would venture ladies. And then also the, now I will say this, the tech fleece poncho, go on eBay. That's probably where you're gonna find it. That's where I found mine and I have two of them. So go on eBay to be able to find that. And finally, I had to give a Jordan one look. Jordan ones are worn a lot of times with cargo tech style pants. Um, you can look on Instagram for streetwear and you'll see that a lot. I went to my Brettos because they're one of my favorite shoes of all time, hence I have a picture back there. Um, I went with my Bretto ones and then I decided to go with the red Jordan jersey, just that gray and red. It's, it's a perfect match. It's perfect match at least you know i think so so that's what i decided to go with you guys can let me know in the comment section uh how do you like the outfits that i put together i'm always curious to be able to see and did it give you an idea of how you may want to style other cargos that you have in your collection or do you need to kind of update your closet and add some um again i got these at black taylor it's not a sponsor video just i really like their clothing and i plan to get more so what i really need to do during this time here while I have so much time at home. I probably need to make a list of all the different styles and colors that I want. And then as disposable income is set aside, I can just, you know, slowly add more to my closet. That's actually a really great way to be able to treat yourself and not go crazy. But as always, I thank you guys for tuning in. Hopefully you let me know also how you like the new setup. All right, act your age, not your shoe size. Peace out.